Hi, Amber Roberts here from Amber Roberts Images. Today I'm going to do a review of a photo book company called PickPerfect.com. They recently did a photo book for me for my family. I like to do a family book um, every year and I had never used the services of PickPerfect before. So um, I did go through them. I ordered um, a lovely book for them, 52 pages. Um, for the year 2020. So yes, I'm a bit behind, but um, that's life, that's how it is. Um, at least I got it done. And part of the reason that I got it done is because Pick Perfect op offers a design service. So all you have to do is upload your selection of pictures and they will, well, first of all, they will cull them for you if there are any that they think are like duplicates or very similar or don't necessarily add to the story that you want to tell. Um, they will suggest that they are removed from the book. And then the second part of what they do that's really unique is that they offer a design service. So that is custom made. They um, assign a designer to your book and it is completely made from scratch. So that's what I did. I uploaded, I think about 300 pictures for 2020 and um, the designer came back and recommended that we include about 250 of them and at the beginning I was like no I want all of my pictures but then when I actually looked at what they were suggesting I thought actually yeah it's good we can probably we probably don't need all of those pictures because they were quite similar and duplicated um, because the other advantage of cutting down photos is that you have fewer pages which means it's a lower cost so I went ahead with that. Um, I'll just give you a, a quick look at the book. So it came in this box, beautiful presentation box that um, you can order as an extra. And um, let me take that. So this is the book that they sent me. And it's their middle kind of offering, I guess you would call it. So they have three levels of book. They have the photo book, which is, um, I guess I would call it press printed. The papers are much more like, um, the pages are more like um, a magazine. So previous books that I've done, um, they're a lot thinner. So, and they flip like this. So it's really like a magazine and they don't lay flat. They're like that. But in the past, that's what I've always done with my photo books. I've, yeah. This is an example from a very long time ago, 2006. So that's what they call a photo book, Pick Perfect's photo book. And then they have two other levels. The next one up um, is called their Lay Flat book, their Lay Flat album, actually. And what this offers is, first of all, um, thicker pages, so quite stiff pages. And you can also see that it's Lay Flat as well so it opens completely flat which is really good if you want to have a panorama image so let me see if i can find a panorama this is an amazing example of um one of the walks we did in the laval area by lake geneva so if you've got stunning pictures like that um i think lay flat is the way you want to go and they also have a nice selection of covers um, linen, leather or eco-friendly leather and um, you can have a photo cover as well. Um, and then the top um, type of photo book that they offer are called the flush mount albums and those pages are even thicker, it's like really thick uh, card and um, so much more luxurious. I think you have more range of choice in covers as well and you can have acrylic and I think you can have like um, a cameo window as well, if you'd like to do that, as well as the other covers that are offered on the, um, the regular lay flat photo book. So I was really happy with how this came out. Um, uh, I think I went through three revisions with the designer. Um, so I uploaded my pictures. He came back with a, um, a suggestion of which photos to include. I said, yes, go ahead. And um, he then, I guess about a few days later, came back with some 
designs, a suggested design. And some of the pages had uh, variations of choices. So I'm trying to find the one that he made a, like a suggestion. So for example, this one, um, you can see here, there's a suggestion here. You can have the photo kind of just blending in and becoming the background. Or um, another option was just to have this kind of separately as its own photo. So some of the pages um, I had options in, so I could say, you know, option A or B or whatever. Um, and then on each page, um, I could make selections like, please move this page to, you know, page 41 or delete this page. Um, I could also make comments on each photo to say, um, please move to the left hand side or, you know, whatever I wanted to say about each photo. And then there's also an option to add um, text to each page. So I didn't because I didn't really have a lot of time, but some places I put if there was a significant event or an anniversary or something that I really wanted to journal about on that page. So um, we went back and forth like that a few times. And um, when he came back, I think the third time, I was really happy with what he was proposing. And so, um, I went ahead and said, yeah, let's go to print. So then after that, I guess it was the next day, he came back and said, actually, there's a couple of your pictures that are quite um, pixelated. And so he was just advising me that they would not come out really sharp. And I said, that's okay. Um, I took them on my phone and it, one of them was this one. I don't know if you can see, so it was my son, um, it's quite dark. I took it on my phone and I think I'd even zoomed in and cropped it. So it really was quite pixelated. But for me, it's just more important to have that memory and the, that picture included in my book. So I said, please include it anyway. I just, I know it's gonna be pixelated, but um, you know, I just accept that. And um, I went ahead and we went to print. So um, I guess it took about 10 days for delivery printing and delivery um about that um and so yeah arrived by career um i wonder if it's printed in germany because i did have to pay a bit of import tax not much at all it was like five francs so nothing at all but i just i wasn't expecting that um but i'm super happy with the book um so really grateful to pick perfect i think it's a really great service for people who are just really busy but want to do it. It's important to them to get all their memories in a book um, or if they just don't have the patience to do it or um, I guess experience or knowledge or whatever. Um, so it's very easy working with Pick Perfect. They have their designers that, that do it all for you basically. There's no software, you just upload your pictures. I think you do have to create an account but um, you just upload them and then yeah, they take it from there. Um, so in terms of cost, um, I think their basic, uh, well, their standard square book, 21 centimeter squared starts at 69 francs 90. Um, and then this one is 30 centimeters square, um, starts at 125 francs, um, something like that. So this, I added quite a few extra pages. I've got 52 pages in this, about 250 photos. And um, so this came out to about 200 francs. And then for the design service, um, it costs 95 centimes per page. And then if you also want to ask them to do some culling and kind of removing of some pictures, that's three centimes a photo. So um, this book costs 250 francs. But honestly, I think it's a little bit more pricey than other books that I've paid for. But when I look at it as a whole, um, the quality is amazing. The pages are really thick. Um, you know, I've, before I've just printed on like magazine type pages. So it's really stunning and I'm really happy, especially with the panoramic pictures. I think it's just been, it's really worth it if you've got great pictures that you want to, that you want to capture and, and really have an amazing and impactful result on. Um, plus the fact that it's so easy, you don't have to do anything really. Um, you just upload your pictures and then every few days um, you'll see your um, 
uh, I guess you know the, the the suggested album, and you just say yes or no. We'll make a few suggestions, and um, then you say yeah, I'll go to print. So instead of spending days, which is what I was literally maybe a week for each um, photo book, it's literally just like probably an hour tops. So um, I really think it's worth it. Um, if if something like this is valuable to you and having your family pictures all in one book, but you don't have the time to do it, I can really recommend Pick Perfect. So um, I hope you found that helpful. Head over to pickperfect.com. I think they've got a special offer at the moment if you want to get going with your first book. And um, yeah, let me know how you get on with your photo books. I'm Amber from Amber Roberts Images. See you soon.